So in Remnant 2, there is a bunch of loot you can get, including a very, very good like handgun, secondary weapon, whatever you want to call it. And in this video, I'm going to explain the best way I can to get it because I believe some of it is complete RNG. So the first thing you need to do is make sure you are in the Rood. It's one of the worlds in the game, so you've got Losum, Yasha, and the Rood. Make sure you are in the Rood. Then what you're going to do is explore the map, and you're going to look for this massive circle on your mini-map or your map that's going to have an elevator at the edge of that circle. That is going to be something called a supply ship. And what you're going to do is go down to the bottom floor or like the middle floor or something. There's going to be a dungeon you can enter. When you go through the dungeon, there's going to be a fuse box and you basically sort that out. You restore power to this supply ship. And once you have done that, you've completed that dungeon, you come back out, that supply ship is going to be ready to go. Then what you need to do is you need to roam around and look for, I'm going to call them coffins. They look like little coffins, they're supply pods. But you are going to look for these and when you come across, them you can interact with them and you can kick them it's going to set them off and they're going to start beeping you might have found them already before the supply ship but you'll know because you kick them and they start beeping so what you need to do is roam around and we did this in the eon vault that's the uh, like basically part of the route we were in we had to roam around eon vault looking for them there are five of these supply pods or coffins that you need to find and when you find them the supply ship's got its power that ship is going to come over is going to pick up the supply pod and take it back to base so you need to roam around find all of them and once you have found every single one of the pods that's why i said there's rng i don't think they have a specific position that they are in some of them are going to be on the floor some of them you might have to do a little bit of climbing but they will be in that area. You don't need to go through any doors or anything like that to find them. They're just in the open area of the Eon Vault. Or well, that's at least where we found them. And once you have every single one of them, all you do is go back to where that supply ship sits, like back to his base. You go down to the very bottom floor and you are going to see these supply pods, except they are now going to be open. And once you have collected them all, you're going to need every single one of them to get the last like item, loot drop or whatever, which is going to be your handgun but you get lots and lots of goodies from this including i don't know if it was a ring or something we already had but there was one of them where we collected our loot and it was over 500 scrap in a single collection so all you've got to do is restore power to the supply ship go and find all of the supply pods and kick them to get them to start beeping ship picks them up takes them back to its base you go to the base when you think you've collected them all i wouldn't spend hours and hours roaming around there are six pods in total but one of them already starts at the supply ship. So you've got to find another five. If you lose track, don't keep roaming around and looking for them because that could potentially set you back hours and hours. Go back to the supply ship base, go down to the bottom floor and see how many are there. But I highly, highly recommend you get every single one of them because the last one that opens up is going to be the star shot secondary or handgun weapon that is incredible in this game. So that is how you gain access to the star shot weapon in Remnant 2. And on that note, we are going to leave the video there. If you enjoyed it, leaving a like is appreciated. If you wish to support me further as a creator, there are links in the description. Let me know your thoughts about the video in the comments. And if you want to watch more, you can click the video on screen. All support on the channel is greatly appreciated and I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you for watching.